here in a suburban Houston park of Katy, Texas. And we're enjoying studying a burr oak. I've had some crown damage, not quite. It's only a pretty nice rounded full crown. The leaves are quite striking, with the deep sinuses. See my hand for scale. Yeah, quite beautiful foliage. And then the acorns that are developing, that's where the burr comes from. So an acorn will peek out the, the bottom of this burr covering. So these are quite a soft texture to start with, and they'll become a little more coarse. The bark is quite coarse on the burr oak. That's one way to tell it from some of the other oaks. It'll be more coarse than the white oak. A live oak, which is across the way, that has quite a fine textured bark, really. It's like a rather nondescript bark on the live oak. So the burr oak, yeah, beautiful textured leaves, a bit coarser. It's a bit more open in its youth than some of the other oaks, than the live oak or the water oak. And to my estimation, it's a nice rough rustic um, trunk. tolerant of a variety of soil conditions. Not a wetland loving plant, but it'll tolerate some wet, in my experience. It'll tolerate drought, significant heat, and some of the recent freezes we've had in Texas. It appears not to have any freeze damage.